amen. That's what you thought. I can straighten them out. <laughs> so I say amen. amen. Everybody get in my bed and leave me alone. <laughs> Keep my name right down now. You know about it. Let me glad somebody prayed for you. <laughs> amen. amen. All right, let's move on here, right? See, see God will guide his servants. Yeah. Am I saying that? Amen. That's why it's always good if you meet somebody, take and meet your mama or your daddy. Amen. Because sometimes they look at them. Soon they walk, soon they get walking in. Uh -uh. No. Baby, I ain't trying to get your business. You know, you know, I ain't trying to get your business, baby, but. Um, you, you don't need you get, get to know. I ain't got to get to know. Him, right? Now, with God, you sometimes you better listen, amen. All right, let's go to the word of God. Now, in Jonah 1 and 1, I'm gonna get out here, amen. In Jonah 1 and 1, Jonah 1 and 1, read from the English Standard Version. Now, the word of the Lord came to Jonah, the son of Amin Amina, saying, Arise, go to Nineveh, that great city, and call out against it, for the evil has come before me. Many times, I'm not y'all talking about the house. Many times God will speak to you and tell you what you gotta do. Yes. Somebody say amen. amen. But, but like Jonah, many of us gotta make a decision whether I'm gonna do what God told me to do. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Some of you think, amen, if you came here today just because you were visiting or whatever. No, the Spirit of God really used somebody to tell you this is what you need to be today. Amen. Because you didn't know how to hear the voice of God. Right. Somebody say amen. amen. Don't think because you're God that God will not speak to you. Amen. Somebody say amen. 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 I was 18 years old and God spoke to me. Amen. When I was 7 or 8, I was watching Billy Bear Crusade. Somebody say amen. amen. They got to see the song, just as I am, I come to thee. Yeah. I looked around, nobody was watching, nobody was watching TV but me. And I said, Lord, come to my life. <laughs> amen. amen. I never get coming home one night, amen, praise God, amen, and I was high, amen, drunk, amen, had my little buzz high, and come on somebody, uh -huh. drive my little car and I flip them back to the radio, you gotta, gotta turn and do you pick up something? Yeah. Uh -huh. I picked up Randy, somebody say amen. Amen. I never get to stay Randy, and the preacher came over the air and he said, what in hell do you want? <laughs>
because God is showing you, amen, amen, you made in my image, and as I know you, you ought to know me. Amen. Someone say amen. amen. And many times, people, God, listen to me. Amen. You get nothing else out of this, right? Know when you're in the presence of God. Amen. Learn how to know when God is speaking to you. Yeah. Amen. A lot of things we can save ourselves from. If we can just listen to what God is telling us. Amen. Don't go here tonight. Amen. Stay home. Amen. You don't need to go there. Amen. Pick the heart. Don't pick that phone up. Yeah. Okay. That's what I call ID for. I won't bless you. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Take a look see who it is. Don't pick it up. Oh, I'm just going to see what they want. <laughs> How many been there before? Amen. You know you shouldn't have, but you go, ah, let's see what they want. Somebody say amen. amen. See, that was God telling me from the get-go. Leave it alone. Yeah. Amen. Let's move on. Now, uh, three practices for hearing God's voice. I'm, see, a lot of times, you've got to practice. Practice. How many of you found out that when you play sports, the, the more you practice, the better it is? Yes. Amen. Any athletes in the house? Any athletes in the house? Amen. Why do you think you practice so much? So I say amen. Amen. You practice to get better. Amen. So let me let me give you some practices, amen, you can try out and do to hear the voice of God. Number one is you gotta get in a quiet place. Light is noisy, is it not? Yes. You got, you got 24 hour TV. That's right. Somebody say amen. Yeah. How many, how many, uh, well, Pastor John, Keith, and a few of us, Vince Carlos, Taylor, Mother, uh, Doc, some of us remember at 12 o'clock. TV side. <laughs> that was it. To you young people, that was in the TV. <laughs> The television is not going off the air. Okay. Somebody say amen. 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 Back then, if you missed the show, you missed it. But no on demand. Somebody say amen. But no recorder, it was gone. Somebody say amen. amen. Are you, did you miss? See so and so? You missed it. Oh man. Amen. So you gotta get in the choir. Just life right for now too noisy. Somebody say amen. amen. How many of you, amen, can't even go to the bathroom out your phone? <laughs> Come on now, we're in church, you can tell the truth. How many of you bring up the halfway there and you know you gotta go, go, ooh, ooh, oh, I got my phone. How many you been going to work and be late for work to go back and get your phone? <laughs> I'm going to have to be late this morning. I'm going to get my phone, man. And some of you will leave it and get mad as firework. What's wrong with her today? Nothing, just going about the minute, guys. Right? <laughs> Somebody say amen. amen. We, we, we need to find a quiet place sometimes and spend some time with God. So a lot of times we can't, we can't hear God because we're hearing other voices. Okay. We're hearing so many other noises yes. and so many other. Sometimes you're not, even though you're not hearing your the messages are sin right now, you look, you're, you're looking, amen, and they are speaking to your mind, are they not? That's right. That's right. The quotes, the comments amen. are speaking to what? Your mind. Yes. And you find yourself laughing at stuff, right? Well, I don't believe they said that. Yeah. Child, please. <laughs> amen. I've seen some people put on, put on their, in a Facebook, put a message up. I'm telling you now, keep my mind, keep my name out your mouth. And they text it on Facebook. They put it on Facebook and Twitter. Yeah. You be like, screenshot. That's personal. <laughs> Take it to who you got. Screenshot. Send them a message and nothing else. Send them a message. <laughs> Amen. Don't put that to everybody to hear. All right, let's move on. Amen. So get into a quiet place. Spend some time, praise God, where you can break away from everything. Spend some time. Sometimes at night, if I'm watching TV and get you know, about 11, 12, sometimes I just, I'm like, off. I'm tired of you. I don't want to hear you no more. Either I sit in my bedroom or sit out there in the living room, praise God, in the dark, and just turn on and start reading the scriptures or reading the message or whatever, right? That quiet time. Amen. And sometimes when I'm studying a lesson, I can be studying, I can start at 8 o'clock before I know it. It's 12, 1, 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Are y'all feeling me here? Yeah. When you get quiet time with God, amen, sometimes you be like, I'm going to go over here, go there. You can study God's word, you be like, man, I ain't going over. Amen. 
But sometimes you need that quiet time, and you'll be surprised how time will just fly by. And you spend time with God. Amen. All right, let's move on. Thank you. Oh, amen. Let's go back. Give some more. All right. Here we go. Now, another point that you've got to practice is priority. Somebody say amen. amen. You have the right and you have the advantage because you know what priority, you know what you got to put first, first. Amen. And what's come first is what comes second. Somebody say amen. amen. you got to prioritize what's important to you. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Sometimes some people are just not important. Amen. That's right. I'm not going to talk to you about that. Amen. Amen. Not important. Amen. And you have the ability to do that, right? Amen. We teach children what's important. Amen. I tell my boy all the time, all you got to do now is just live, eat. Somebody say amen. That's right. Get dressed and go to school and learn. Yeah, amen. Yeah, but I got none of you. No, I know that is important. Somebody say amen. Amen. You got to prioritize. What's important? That's right. Acting the clown in class is not important. None. Get suspended is not important. Somebody say amen. amen. Because my thing is this, right? This is the only place you're going to get it for free. Amen. Uh, amen. 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 I'm you out of school right now. Uh, uh, it costs you. I don't care. Community college, whatever. Everything you get now is what? It's going to cost you some money. Amen. And some of you just got it for free. Amen. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. I tell my mom all the time. Uh, my mom told me this, and she only finished the third grade. She said, son, your school days are going to be your best days. Amen. Because back then, at three, third grade, fourth grade, they had to come out of school to work. Amen. Amen. And nothing 